Hey folks, I'm back with a little cup battle. Yeah, I'm so excited. And today I have two reasons to be excited. Because not only is it a little cup battle, but it is a battle against a Lochnar, who is one of my favorite PBR YouTube battlers. Um, he is just hilarious to listen to. I love listening to his battles. Um, but so anyway, I haven't been playing Little Cup enough to know whether these are standard Pokemon that you see in Little Cup um, on his team. I know that uh, Weavile, or not Weavile, Sneasel is uh, oh is sorry Uber uh, and is actually banned from Little Cup. But he said he doesn't play by Smogum Tears and. I had enough counters on the team that I wasn't going to make a big fuss about it. So um, here comes the battle, and uh, I lead off with my Shy Halud, my Onyx. Um, so Piplup, I'm pretty sure, can learn Stealth Rock, so I think I am going to go ahead and taunt here um, just to prevent him from setting up entry hazards. Uh, here comes the taunt, and you know I think he's probably going for the Surf, um, but I just didn't know for certain. Um, Piplup does, in fact, go ahead and go for the Surf. Uh, so cute. I love how cute Little Cup is. Super effective. Gets me down to my Focus Sash. Um, Onyx is going to probably be a really important Pokemon in Gen 5 Little Cup because of Sturdy um, and the fact that it can have Stealth Rocks and it's also pretty fast. Um, but uh, it, it's such a free Focus Sash. So anyway, yeah, my Onyx didn't really get to do much in this match except for set up Stealth Rocks, but um, it did its job uh, and I salute you. Um, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and send in Chin Chow. So, now, the last battle that I uploaded to this channel, I don't know if uh, all you who watch my PBR battles watch my DS battles, but if you did, you saw probably the most epic thing in the world, a Lantern Sweep. Um, well, uh, I bet you didn't think that anything could be quite as epic. Um, anyway, uh, this is actually the same breed. So, uh, I predict the switch out of Piplup, and I think that he's probably going to th predict me to do an Electric-type move, and so he's going to send in his Geodude. Um, Focus Sash, if he has it, is broken now thanks to those Stealth Rocks. And I go ahead and go for the Surf. Perfect prediction. 4x effective. Geodude is one hit KO'd. Which is great because I'm not sure if it's faster, but if it is, um, Earthquake would probably have done me in in one hit. So I've taken out probably my biggest counter. Um, oh, there's Badu though. Um, but Badu is um, a special attacker, and this is a special defensive Chin Chow. Plus, I carry the Ice Beam. Um, so Ice Beam is going to be an easy 2-hit KO. I'm a little bit disappointed that it didn't 1-hit KO, but it is what it is. Badu goes ahead and Giga Drains, I'm like, oh no, that's got to be it. And then look at the... It, Angler takes that hit. And so um, I'm going to be able to KO on the next turn, and that's kind of awesome. Uh, I'm getting a little Chin Chow Sweep going. Yeah, uh, so by the way, if you didn't uh, click the annotation um, in the last battle, um, you should absolutely just watch... Um, the video I made of a lantern sweep set solely to O Fortuna, no narration, just epic lantern sweepiness. There's going to be a link in the uh, description here, maybe a link in the annotations, but you should totally check that out too. Um, but so anyway, um, he's got this sweep, his sneasel, and I guess this is why he felt it was okay to use it. It's not a physical sneasel, it's a special sneasel, which is like the weirdest thing ever because, um, you know, Sneasel has amazing uh, attack, but awful spec attack, so really strange. Um, but I guess, you know, really don't mind that he's using it since it's, it is that way. Um, had he taken out my Chin Chow, I would have just sent out my uh, Focus Sash Mankey, and I would have KO'd him with a um, close combat, and that would have been that. Anyway, um, I don't want to KO with Surf, but I'm going to two hit KO, and I'm going to take that uh, Dark Pulse. Yeah, just. It's really weird that he used Dark Pulse on his Sneasel, but I've taken down his Sneasel, and I am ripping through his team. That is, what now, three KOs for my uh, little Chin Chow? And so, next up for him is an Elekid in a um, Luxury Ball, so, um, I mean, I don't care. I don't care if you change your Pokeballs. Um, I mean, if this were maybe a tournament, it would matter because then you know if it's Brud or something. But I don't care uh, if you make your team with Focus Save and give them interesting Pokeballs. Um, anyway, uh, Eloki goes for the Brick Break, and I'm thinking, oh man, this is Death of Angler. But look, it survives! And I mean, this is a specially defensive um, Chin Chow, but it's just awesome! It's just sweeping through his team. And so I get off the, um, the T Wave. Yeah, so this is actually funny here. Uh, I was like, oh man, he's gonna send in his Elocator, and I can't really, you know, I can't use Electric type moves because he's got Motor Drive. 
And then I look it up, it's like, oh, he doesn't have motor drive. Yeah, Elegant doesn't get motor drive. So that's really awesome that I can just paralyze it. And now I take it out with a Surf. Maybe I should just use Surf first turn, but whatever. It works out the same anyway. I was just predicting that Chen Chao was going to die at any point. Um, and so now he is down to his last Pokemon. I, I think this is the last Pokemon. Um, no, he's got two more. Okay, so he sends out Piplup. Uh, I think T-Bolt is going to be an easy one-hit KO, and that's now five KOs for my little Chin Chow, and I've got a little Chin Chow sweep here, and it's just the awesomest thing ever, especially considering my last battle with a Lantern sweep. So, yeah, I'm just really new. Yeah, his last Pokemon is Bagon, and he knows I have Ice Beam, and, uh, I am not sure whether I'm gonna be faster, because, again, I haven't played Little Cup too much, I'm hoping I'm going to be faster, and indeed I am. I go ahead and go for the Ice Beam. I figure maybe he has Yachi Berry, but he doesn't. And uh, one hit KO, and uh, Bagon is history, and I have swept Alaknar with a freaking Chin Chow, which has got to be the most epic thing ever. Anyway, uh, Alaknar, uh, great battle. If you ever want to battle again, let me know. Um, maybe I'll leave my Chin Chow at home. Comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge. So long.